Hey everybody, this is Don Thornton again, and I wanna just go over and do a quick video of a property that I just got, a uh, new short sale. Uh, this is down in Vero Beach. And uh, first impressions, looks like it's gonna need a new roof, which is fine for my short sale stuff. Concrete block house, you know, it's, uh, uh, so far it looks okay. I'm gonna go inside and check everything out. Uh, they have an interesting thing here, they did a garage, uh, a garage conversion and i guess they uh try to make it into a mother-in-law apartment but we'll i'll check it out here um the house looks like it's in pretty decent condition except for the roof like i said um you know they came in here and this is like the mother-in-law bathroom that they put in here and then what they try to do was put a uh they got a yeah they try to put like a half this is where they put the bath. Well, I guess they, yeah, this is the bath, and then they got they tried to put a shower in here, which is interesting. And then they've got the uh, um, kitchen here. So interesting what they were trying to do here. Uh, the rest of the house is okay. Like I said, this is the uh, uh, dining room, kitchen. Uh, they took the appliances, which is not, which is not unusual um this is the um living room of course go in here to the back rooms this is a bedroom looks like it's in decent shape and uh, we'll go over here this is a common bath also not looking bad this is actually not a bad house um price right it should sell pretty well on a resale so and then here's the uh uh, I think this is the master. I guess you don't have a master bedroom here. I guess it's just a one. Um, I guess it was originally just just a three one, but I don't know what you call that conversion. That's <laughs> I'll leave that to my superstar uh, short sale broker, Mona Rosario. I'll let her do all of that. But um, just looking at things, I mean, not much. And you got a little bit of a something there on the ceiling. But, you know, yeah, I'm not seeing much to work with so far. Baseboards are pretty clean. Um, you know, so uh, this one's going to be a little bit harder to get a discount on besides the roof. So uh, we'll see. I mean, you never know, right? It's all, it's not just about, this is not just about, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, not just about condition. There's other things you can do to get discounts. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and shut this, lock the door here. Give me a second. I'll lock it up. Put it back in the lock box. Boom. Okay, so we'll go look here on the outside. So we got some stuff here that I can certainly use. Got some cracking. Um, on the stucco down here, we have looks like they repaired a crack here, and uh, so we'll continue to go down here and look. The windows, no cracking on the windows, uh, the sides, you know, I don't see anything major here. You know, I'm not worried about that too much. Let's go over here to the uh, front. Hard to see with the bush here when we go around. But again, there's no real cracking around the windows. That's what I always look for is the windows. See what's going on there. And then I'll, the front, so like I said, it's a nice solid concrete block. So that's, you know, that's always good. Uh, you know, you can tell this is where the thing was. So anyway, going in the side. Yeah, I mean, honestly, it's a decent house. So, um, like I said, the, the bad news is that this we got some animals coming in here. I'll have to get that fixed at some point. Definitely gonna have wildlife in there. Uh, but yeah, in general, nice little backyard. So I would say that, uh, you know, this would be a, uh, a decent house on a resale because you don't have to do anything to it. There's not, this is not much of a pig. You know, lipstick on a pig type situation. You wouldn't have to put much lipstick on this one. 
so that always helps on the resale so um so yeah i mean uh this is a nice situation the the homeowner moved to vegas so he filed a chapter seven bankruptcy um i don't know a year or two a couple years ago or whatever it's just been sitting and uh so yeah it's a uh it's a good thing so uh you know just goes to show you too that uh you can still get you can still get houses from uh stuff that happened a long time ago um i mean you know these are old 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 information that still can still can bring you um uh houses because think about it not a lot of people are going to go after the, the old ones so keep that in mind as you're thinking about your um marketing strategies for trying to get short sales or trying to find you know real estate uh distressed real estate is um you just have to make sure you know the court records really well so you you know that that you have to uh check on the docket and make sure that it's still um you know it's not 10 days before a foreclosure auction or something like that you know so anyway that's the the video of this house and uh thanks for subscribing or watching my channel